the superior? <laughs> what a crude question. What we are is different. You, you're an empire of morph, each flapping off on its own, searching for the light. We're hornets, part of a hive. Yes, on our own, you might match us, three of yours against three of ours. And we'll see how the dice fall. A swarm, General, that's what we are. Our sleepers will bleed you, our twisted feed off your blood. All the while, our harvesters reap the souls of your fallen, and our emissaries reanimate their hulls as our servants. But above all, you serve yourself. We serve something greater. an enterprising tycoon, each new day brings new opportunities in your quest for success. Exploiting gaps in the market and meeting demand is all in a day's work for a canny entrepreneur. And expanding your business is necessary if you're to keep up with the times. But with capitalism comes competition. Astute rivals and self-sufficient towns will soon leave you looking for that next niche in the market. And a change of entrepreneurial tactics might be necessary in order to fend off financial collapse. However, be wary of your fledgling setup. A poorly planned infrastructure will grind your business to a halt, and badly placed polluting industry will be sure to harm your reputation and quickly turn your business allies into foes. But the savvy business person will have all this under control with well-executed trade routes by road, water, air, and rail. And a well-targeted PR campaign will soon have those green towns and villages back on side and accepting your goods. All that's left to worry about is what you're going to produce next. For you are an industrialist and success is in your blood. And who knows what the next new day will bring in Rise of Industry. to make this day possible. But here we stand, and before us lies our ultimate goal. Holy Jerusalem! Brothers, God has heard our prayers and given us a chance for revenge. We shall not waste it. Death to the infidels! Jihad! Wait 
to play a survival RTS game. It's just fun to kind of share the challenge. It is so much fun to share that victory, you know, with somebody. And it's also nice too, because one person can manage one thing while somebody else manages something else. I think that the main impetus for making this game um, was our love for other experiments that are going on in the RTS genre right now. I am a big fan of Frostpunk. We all fell in love with their abilities. I want to, we want to make a game that has some, some of the elements that, that this has because it's really fun to, you know, like, build and survive. These are great games and they're great examples of... Ever since I was young, there was all this talk about the new lines coming through, changing life as we know it. One day, I saw it with my very own eyes. New tracks are being built, businesses starting up, and those trains sure did come.
and extinction is imminent. An invitation from deep space offers a second chance, and so begins the era of Pax Nova. Discover new worlds and the secrets they hold. Meet new allies and foes and fight for our survival once more. We should have learned our lesson. But have we? Let's move our heavy spears forward to climb the walls. Now is the time to press the attack. Getting the Azure Dragons firing, and now charging forwards with the Yellow Dragons. Is there a heart beating in that spineless body? Is there a brain inside that cavernous head? These heavy hitting axe units are a formidable foe for anyone they go up against. They will make very short work of these spears. Let's check up on the center attack. The settlement is now on fire from the barrage of arrows, and our men are getting over the walls and getting stuck into the enemy. Yes! Back them! Cousin, we come to aid you. We ride with fury at our back. Our reinforcements have arrived. This huge mass of cavalry will be the perfect thing to break Lubu's men. We'll charge them into this spear infantry. They're going to knock these guys flying and destroy their morale. Our reinforcements are led by Jehau Dun. He was shot in the eye by an arrow in battle against Lubu. He pulled it out, his eye still attached to the arrow, and proceeded to eat it. And we're going to get him out of the fight and head over to Lubu, who we're going to challenge to a duel. Duels are a new feature for Three Kingdoms, where the two heroes will duke it out in single combat until one either dies or retreats. Duels can help you single out an enemy combatant and take them out and turn the tide of battle. The Unending War, a powerful, unbridled AI network, the shadows of a machine army, bloody conflicts over the cursed Lost Tech artifacts, and now a new battleground awaits. Adventure freely as the fires of war expand to new areas, new missions, difficulties, and numerous challenges await. Unlock new units and lead the White Fangs to victory. Revive the ancient bloodline. Protect your loved ones. Lead the future of the human race. All units, battle stations. Tiny Metal, Full Metal Rumble. Something strange is going on all across the zone. Ghouls are disappearing and getting replaced by copies. But they're made out of plants. I call them pod ghouls. I've walked from one end of this wasteland to the other. I don't fear nothing. Until now. A lot's happened since you've been traveling, Khan. We could use your skills. Stalkers got each other's backs, right? What happens to you happens to me. 